Sorry, my ch ch uh, child tax credit right. has decreased by almost right. 80%. <sighs> Last year, I broke my neck. Um, I almost lost... You have a beautiful voice, by the way. Thank you so much. Yep. I'm having a panic attack right now. <laughs> oh, no. Like, no panic. <laughs> oh, right my God. God. Yeah. This country can become rich with the use, the proper use of tariffs. It'll Did keep you just companies. float out the idea of getting rid of income taxes and replacing it with tariffs? Well, okay. Were you serious about that? Our, yeah, sure. But why not? Because we... Ready? Our country was the richest in the... Relatively in the 1880s and 1890s. A president who was assassinated named McKinley. He was the tariff king. He spoke beautifully of tariffs. His, his language was really beautiful. Uh, we will not allow the enemy to come in and take our jobs and take our factories and take our workers and take our families unless they pay a big price. And the big price is tariffs. And he'd speak like that, but he was right. And then around in the early 1900s, they switched over stupidly to, frankly, an income tax. And you know why? Because countries were putting a lot of pressure on America. We don't want to pay tariffs. Please don't. You know, they, believe me, they control our politicians.